Well, we've heard it a lot since the pandemic began. Just try to be patient and kind with one another. And a local care facility is taking that thought to the next level. Erica Ramsey and Brittany Tidrick join us from the Rutherford House in Fremont and the Seneca House in Tiffin to explain. Ladies, good morning. Thanks for joining us today. Good morning. Good morning. So you guys are doing something really cool, something called Be Kind to Humankind Week. Tell me about this event. So Be Kind to Humankind Week is an annual celebration of kindness. Um, it takes place from August 25th to August 31st every year um, and is a global event. At Rutherford House and Seneca House, we like to use this time to bring positivity to the communities that we serve. So what kinds of activities uh, do communities participate uh, during, this, during this week? Well, we have adopted the, the suggested calendar in ways that allow us to provide random acts of kindness throughout our community. We like to keep these acts of kindness a surprise until the day of the event. <laughs> this allows the element of surprise and excitement for our teams at Rutherford House and Seneca House and of course the recipients. So we want to keep it, you know, hush hush a little bit. We want to, we want to keep it a surprise for these folks. Uh, maybe give us a little hint. What are some of the, the things you've done in, the, in past events? Well, each day of the week, we try to do something that we feel will make an impact within our community. In the past, we have donated food to local food banks as well as communities that provide temporary housing. We have provided cold beverages for our resp first responders. We have provided grocery gift cards to random community members, as well as, of course, cookies for kindness that were delivered throughout our community. This year, we have some plans to reach multiple generations, multiple service industries, and expand our reach through new avenues. So we're really excited. Yeah, and I and I think right now it's so hard. You know, we're in the middle of a pandemic, and I know being at a, a, an assisted living facility there too, uh, we have to be really careful uh, with with your clients who live there and your residents who live there. But we want to get involved. How can we all get involved in this? Well, of course, kindness is welcome any time of the year. Um, but during this time. There's different initiatives that you can do just to brighten someone's day, um, just to remember that there are things that, that people need throughout the year and just kind of to bring awareness to that. Um, bringing someone's trash cans in from the street, maybe assisting a senior with a grocery delivery during this time, because that can be a challenge um, or a scary thing for seniors to get out and do if, if they're not comfortable doing that, or just sending a kind note to somebody. Um, there's nothing too big or too small that, that you can do. The important thing to do is to be conscious of ways that, that we can take small steps every day to create a better and brighter world. Yeah, you know, it's really great when people do these acts of kindness. Are you guys going to be recognizing folks for, for their acts? We would love to. So um, besides our two communities, Rutherford House and Seneca House, just going out and um, performing these random acts of kindness, we would love for other people to be involved as well. Um, what we'd like to do is recognize those people who, who spread kindness throughout the community. If someone completes an act of kindness, takes a photo with a short explanation of, of what they're doing, goes to one of our Facebook pages. Um, so if you're in the Fremont area, the Rutherford House Facebook page. Um, if you're in the Tiffin area, the Seneca House Facebook page. Like that page, send us your photo and explanation. Um, and we'll message you directly and get a gift out to you. We want to make sure that we're recognizing people who, who just contribute in positive ways throughout the community as well. Yeah, it's really, really great that this is a, we're focusing a week on this. Um, we should be doing it all the time, right? But um, sometimes we need to just give uh, people a little, a little uh, incentive there. Uh, let's, let's get out and be kind to one another. It's a really difficult time right now. Um, in the meantime, if folks want to learn more about the Rutherford House and Seneca Houses, uh, how can they get more information about your assisted living communities? Well, if someone wants to reach Rutherford House, they can contact us at 419 334-6962. And at Seneca House, if you're looking for additional information, 419-443-8184. We'd love to hear from you and um, we'd love for you to participate with us in just bringing awareness to, to spreading kindness. Sounds good. Can't wait to see what, what you guys come up with, uh, your surprises uh, that, uh, that uh, folks uh, get to participate in and uh, just see how everybody's being kind to one another. Ladies, uh, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank, thank you. you very much. Take care.